King Charles furious as Prince Harry requests money for reconciliation before peace deal. We're about to uncover a revelation that paints a rather disheartening picture of Prince Harry's intentions and actions toward his own family. Just how far can one go, and how disappointing can it be to prioritize personal gain over genuine reconciliation? It has recently come to light that Prince Harry may be seeking reconciliation with his father, King Charles. However, the motivation behind this potential reconciliation might not be what you'd expect. It appears that money is a significant driving force behind Harry's actions in this matter. According to royal biographer Angela Levin, Harry has been relentless in his pursuit of financial gain, to the extent that he's making his own father, King Charles, rather miserable with his public antics. When Harry and Meghan Markle stepped away from the royal family in 2020, Queen Elizabeth made it clear that if Harry wasn't going to be a working royal, he couldn't have one foot in and one foot out. As a result, they were no longer funded by the Royal Fund after their departure. But here's the truly shocking part, Harry's behavior since then has shown a complete lack of respect for his own family. He's been nagging his father for years, demanding apologies and requesting money. This doesn't appear to be the actions of a loving son seeking healing. Angela Levin rightly labels Harry as phony because his actions don't align with the values of a genuine family. If he treats his own family so poorly, it raises questions about whether he truly understands what a real family is all about. It's disheartening to hear that Harry has been using his family as a means to an end, making their lives miserable with his constant demands. It seems that his focus isn't on rebuilding relationships, it's on extracting more money and resources. Even King Charles, who undoubtedly loves his son, is reportedly hesitant to reconnect with Harry and Meghan until he witnesses positive changes on their part. The question we must now ask is whether Harry and Meghan are genuinely willing to change their ways or if their pursuit of wealth will continue to take precedence. Recent reports of the Sussexes facing financial challenges and losing their lucrative partnership with Ideal only add to the complexity of this situation. It's evident that maintaining their lavish lifestyle is a top priority, but at what cost? It's a sorrowful state of affairs when personal gain outweighs the importance of family and genuine reconciliation. Just how far will Prince Harry go in his quest for success, and at what point will he realize the true value of family? The world is watching, and it's high time for some serious self-reflection. King Charles is doing a very admirable job of controlling the problems with Markle and Harry. What he is dealing with is a psychopath. And the psychopath has no conscience. The king should try hard not to let the requests of Harry bother him. Rather, he should permit his lawyers to deal with Harry, knowing that Harry is influenced by a psychopath. King Charles might find it much more calm in his life if he would let his best lawyers control the intrusions of Harry and his requests. That should end the need to ever have conversation with Markle or Harry again. King Charles is very, very good with the management of money. British government has been so helpful in keeping other things in order regarding Harry and Markle.